your original hometown dealer, Saida, Trudeau Chrysler, Jeep, Dodge, and Ram. On March 25th, the Center for Biological Diversity sued the U.S. Bureau of Land Management for failing to develop legally mandated management plans for Gold Butte as well as Basin and Range National Monuments in a timely fashion. Both national monuments were designated to safeguard important habitats for endangered species and fragile cultural areas which require active management. The press release stated, quote, We're suing because the landscapes, plants, animals, and cultural resources these monuments are supposed to protect are suffering from the BLM's continued neglect, said Patrick Donnelly, Great Basin Director at the Center for Biological Diversity. Preservation doesn't just happen. That's why agencies have legal mandates to develop plans for the protection of these landscapes. It's time for the BLM to fulfill its duty to actively manage and protect Nevada's national monuments. President Barack Obama designated Basin and Range National Monument in 2015 and Gold Butte National Monument in 2017 through presidential proclamations under the Antiquities Act. The proclamations specifically state that the BLM shall prepare and maintain a management plan for the monuments, a requirement that the agency has ignored. Basin and Range was designated to protect wide open landscapes and fragile cultural areas like the Mount Irish Archaeological Site. Gold Butte was designated to protect essential desert tortoise habitats and renowned cultural sites like Falling Man. Visitation to these areas has increased dramatically and human waste has proliferated in camping areas and near cultural sites. Meanwhile, unmanaged cattle grazing is degrading valuable riparian or wetlands adjacent to rivers and streams habitats and harming desert tortoises. President Obama designated these national monuments because they're areas of exceptional importance to the whole nation, but the BLM's failure to follow the law is leading to them deteriorating in front of our eyes, said Donnelly. Our national monuments are precious, the best of the best. We're taking the BLM to court to ensure they're treated that way.